got set in. It's a long way back in here. Some of you might remember this. This is an earlier video. This is one where I had grace and there was all these rubs right here. And originally I said I was going to set up in a tree over here or I might get across this little creek right here and set up while well, I got across the creek because we, we have a strange east wind. I was going to set up on a bug bed back that way, but with the east end, I tried to circle around, and I sure enough, I busted two deer out of there, and I'm pretty sure that was the buck I'm after. But anyway, you know, you never can tell. There's a big wheat field right over here. There's some acorn trees out into the pasture. Private properties right here. But anyway, last year, there was probably 40 rubs in this area. It was a good staging area. They come out along this creek. If the wind stays true out of the east, it'll be perfect. It's supposed to switch out of the south or even the southeast, which will also be good. There is a chance they might skirt this side of the creek, so I'll have to pay attention there. But This is the only tree I could really get in, and I'm having to stand absolutely butt to the tree in my saddle. <laughs> area too so I might even get a shot of the turkey another thing that I don't like to do but um the tree I'm in is actually dead it's it does have some live branches on it but it's dying and I'm about 15 foot up if it falls over into the creek that's about a 25 foot drop so <laughs> I did bring my compound today simply because I have really hurt my shoulder climbing trees this year so we'll see I've got a 20 yard shot right out to that opening right there 25 to the tree I really think that's going to be my kill shot right there which is a 20 yard shot I want to hit him before he gets to the staging area if he comes in but anyway I now have this tree prepped I had never got back in here to prep any trees so I just now prepped it, and the wind's picking up, and this tree is really moving. <laughs> oh, man, who said deer hunters aren't crazy? Anyway, we'll see how it goes.